Hello everyone, welcome back. So, where were we last time? I believe we were. Oh, we just did the Nile monitors. Yeah. Look at these guys. Tickets are underpriced. Cool. I mean, I can charge you guys more if I want to. Sweet. <coughs> Maybe we need more trash cans by the looks of things. Um, right. So, trash cans. Where are the trash cans? Where are the where are the trash cans? Oh, look at the crocodile just hanging in the water. Oh, that's amazing. Look at them go. Look at them both go. It's like, yeah, we're just kind of hanging out here, Gary. Low welfare, what's the matter? Oh, oh yes, okay, that's fair. Let me, let me, mm. oh, yes, but, yeah, mm, yeah, let, let's just, uh. What, uh, what temperature do you guys usually hang out at? All right, I've heated up. Uh-oh. Cleanliness, what's the matter here? Uh, oh, you know, I bet there are too many animals. Yeah, there are way too many animals. Okay, hold on. I thought I put you guys in contraceptive so you wouldn't do this. Uh oh. Oh, there are so many females. Okay. Uh. Um, yeah. Oh, yes. I might need another keeper in charge of the of the exhibits here. Oh, and let's also check the actual. Yep, okay. Uh keeper. That was like caretaker, I just tired need a keeper. Um well, sorry, three, one for each one. That way that should take care of the problem. Let's go increase ticket prices as well, because they just said we can increase ticket prices. What do you think? Eight, uh, eight dollars? Yeah. Children, of course, have a lower price to get it than adults. Sweet. Okay, let's go here. What's done? Ah, let's go learn about the crocodile. Why not? That sounds like a good plan. Okay. Wow, it is a whiteout right now. Do we have any animals? Oh, we have a bear, don't we? Okay, we should have someone coming to fix the exhibit momentarily. I hope. We'll see, though. What do we got for sale? Some more wolves, hyena, saltwater crocodile. 
Saltwater crocodile, lemurs. I, I want something that's of the habitat we're in. Zebras, wild monitors, peafowls, maybe. Giant turtles, so there's a male, I'll take one. Oh, we'll get some more hogs. Or not. Oh, don't I have a female one of these? Hey, come on, let me buy it. Okay, let's try this again. This is the one probably have with this system where, like, it's so hard to actually get an animal. So hard. We get a sable antelope, why not? If we can, you know, there's actually one for sale. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, I did it. Cool. Come on. Let me buy it. Let me buy him. No way. Okay. And we got a bison and a black bear. Okay. Warthog, bongo. Or did we just get <laughs> oh, They're both males. Oh, I needed a female. All right, let's be on the lookout. <coughs> you know what? Let's also look at what's for conservation credits. Come on. Nothing, huh? All right. <sighs> okay, we'll try once. Nope. Okay. Guess we're just going to stick with what we've got. Oh, wait. Here, the filter's not working. Okay, so what are we looking for? We are looking for a bison or a black bear, okay. American bison filter. Come on, plant zoo. Oh, you. I think it's also my internet. We're going to see. I'm going home next week for Thanksgiving. So we'll see if maybe my internet gets better there. Or maybe it won't. We'll see. But yeah, so uh, let's go and get these antelope in, huh? That sounds like a plan. And I think what I'll do. What I think I'll do is we'll go ahead and set them up right here. Oh, actually, let's get the bison in. You know what? Yeah, let's get the bison in. They're bison, so I assume they're going to need a pretty big habitat, you know? Uh, 
Okay, let's go to pass here. This will, of course, be a staff path, kind of crawling in behind here. And then we'll get a um, um a thingy. Yeah, trans well, do we need a transformer? Not quite, but we're gonna need a water pump. We need a transformer before, before long. Before too long, we'll need one. All right. Okay. Now let's get this. Uh, these the, the this these boys in here. Two little friends. Well, <laughs> they're bison. They're not little. Mind you. There are some. Oh, come on. Yes. We we are going to get a female here too. Excellent. Okay, cool. Let's go back. Let's see how the grizzly bears are doing. <laughs> it's just hanging. <laughs> yes, Everest is expecting offspring. That's great news. For one, they'll put us in with a community challenge, so we'll get more conservation points down here. Two, yes, we'll get a little baby bear in the park. Oh, that's amazing. I know, so I like it. It's plenty with it. Is that a just a cardboard box? That's amazing. Okay. Nice. So I, I kind of like the layout we've got. It's just kind of random, but I, I kind of like it. I assume the bison are going to want some wa some water. Let's give them some water waste. What the, we'll do is have a big like waterway right here. Uh, it's a little bit too much water, I think. There we go. Just like a little shallow pool, you know, for them to kind of jump into when they feel thirsty. Oh, here come the deliveries. Oh, hello. You about to have an offspring too? Look at the, it's just kind of hanging. That's great. Oh, oh I love this game. So just look at the animals. Oh, that's incredible. The baby just pops out. Oh, that's incredible. And we've got a little baby wolf. Oh. And it's a habitat species, so we got some dollars. I don't get conservation points, but you know. Oh, say hello to the person visiting our park. Huh, I wonder why these guys, these guys, oh, there they go, they got fed. How many can there be in a social group? Uh, quite a few. Oh, actually, we should probably have another one. Okay. That's good to know. Let's see if we can get one more. Right. How do you guys feel about your space here? Terrain is perfect. Plenty of space for you to roam around in. That's what I thought. Uh, let's get you a food source here. 
real quick because once again I, I'm pushing the edge of time. Okay, now we want for an American vice. No, nope, no. Nope. Block of ice, a barrel feeder, and a rubbing pillar. Why not? There we go. That's the wrong way. There we go. And then, uh, Just to give them a nice little view of the bison as they wander in. Oh, this is so cool. I I, I can't say this enough, but I love this game. It's just, it's so well detailed and amazing. Look at all the animals. Look, like, look at these guys. Like the two minor animals are just kind of hanging out, having a good time, stepping around. We're positive, of course. And then we've got the alligators. Oh, look at that. Look at that guy. He's just like, yeah, I'm going to eat you if you're not careful. And over here we have the bears, who, which one of them is expecting soon, which is incredible. Oh, wow. That's a little big. Um, got our, our ant ears kind of messing around with the actual ants to eat. And the first acquisition, of course, the, the wolf cub and the wolves. And that's kind of like our, I don't know. I think in the future I want to have um, different sections of the park for different, like, different uh, environments. So like, you know, this is all well and good, but it's kind of a mixture of different biomes. I kind of want to make this, you know, because we've got the wolves. This will probably be the American biome because we've got the bison, timber wolves, and the grizzly bears here. And then we might have like a more aquatic one because of the uh, Nile monitors, the alligators, etc. And then maybe a different one for the anteaters and other... I mean, maybe, maybe we'll uh, put the anteaters and... Sable antelope together. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, that might work. That might work. We'll see, though. I don't know. This is still all very much work in progress. But, uh, yeah, guys. I hope you enjoyed. And uh, I will be seeing you guys next time. Have fun.